Okay. Clean up the laundry while I'm in the bathroom. Mm, first, can't really go downstairs because the family is reading the magic thing and it's probably going to be a little alright sound. And you don't want to hear that. And yeah, I don't think so. Don't count on it. Maybe the human is still gone and, you know, the mother and the sisters gonna go to Staples or Ikea I think the flat table so it's just me and Uncle Jim downstairs and he's watching the game so I don't want to scare him there oh yeah the bathroom in the bathroom not the best of places but it's quiet um sound couch as well and yeah it's a private place strong bath bath clean it's really cold out there, you know? I, I would have wanted to go to Staples or Ikea or wherever they're going, but it's like 24 degrees Celsius outside and that's just not my kind of temperature. So I guess it's easily, you know, how to call it. Whatever. Nothing with you guys. You know, it's, it's lonely here, although there are a lot of nice places to go to. There's always something new around the corner. You know, vending machines all around. People stop and say hi. Little girls saying hi and everything. The people who are actually polite. You don't get that in the Philippines. But then again, you don't really get the kind of friends you have in the Philippines in the United States. So very different. Oh yeah, I've missed like a week of classes, so I don't know if, if the professor is still gonna take me. I think I'll tinker about. Maybe got some of my dog tags. See, every time I walk around, run, move, it is just... See, hear that? Tinker about. My telephone's in coma. You know, the... I think it's the battery problem because when I got here, it took almost 24 hours or more to fully charge battery, sometimes more than 24 hours and it's just, it's killing me, you know? So when I was waiting for my DMV test to come out, DMV results to come out, I, let, I, I, I played with it until the battery ran out. Yeah, it died. And I tried to recharge it and nothing. So I guess I have to buy a new battery then. When I have enough money. Because right now I'm saving for a car and school and a plane ticket. And that's gonna cost me like thousands. Thousands. And how much I got right now? Like maybe a hundred dollars. Wow. I'm so broke. Well, at least I don't have to buy new women to cut. I have to the homeless to get it for me, so. That's like, you know, twenty dollars saved. I can't. Which is great. You know, twenty dollars equals a thousand bucks. Which is so I actually have a bargain. So, when the ticket expires on January 17th, I'll be seeing you guys again, probably earlier than that, as we'll just pressure me to get back by December for the high school reunion, which I really wanted to attend, you know, to meet all those friends again, and my high school, and those young days and everything, and it was college. I really want to attend theater arts and photojournalism and the actual arts. Yeah, I really want to go now. Okay. See you soon. Bye.